G'day. This video is a little bit different to my usual beer videos. But I've been waiting for this box now, ooh, since it was either December or January. Um, what a lot of people might not know is that uh, when we had our second daughter, we were struggling a bit with childcare fees. Um, and if you apply for a course, you get cheaper childcare fees. Now, of course, and it kept me occupied. So I applied for a course in uh, game making. Well, it was actually called uh, Diploma in Screen and Media. But it was based around um, video game design, uh, 3D graphics and animation, um, like the Pixar cartoons and things like that. Now, I um, used to develop games and code games back in the mid-80s in uh, high school on the Commodore 64. And so I knew a fair bit about it, even though things have changed a lot. And uh, a few years earlier than I'd actually applied for the course, I'd started doing the 3D um, animated graphics for people's videos and things, uh, intros for their videos. Um, I did a few, well, I did about 10 for Keg um, King. They only used one, of course, and I did one for Kegland when they started. I've done a few different ones. A lot of the stuff I never upload or show people. I've done a lot of things for my channel that I've never ever used. I sort of spend a lot of time on them, and then I get to them and I get, I don't know if it's embarrassed or something, but anyway, I don't upload them. This is an Oculus development kit, I hope, in this box. Now what that is, is uh, Oculus make the VR headsets, a few different sorts, and uh, as long as you can demonstrate uh, that you're into game development and uh, 3D graphics and all that sort of thing, uh, they can send you a kit if you can apply, and I got accepted, and so I'm hoping that's what's in this box. So let's open this box and we'll have a look. Okay, let's have a look, eh? Exciting. Got the padding. And Oculus Go. How cool is that? A hoodie, or a jumper, anyway. What does it say? There, yeah, hoodie. Oculus hoodie. Pen. Oculus start notebook. Something in here. Oh, an Oculus start glass. We'll have a closer look at these later. Dev kit packing slip. So I take it, this nondescript box is what we're really after. But maybe we should have a closer look at this a bit later. Oh yeah, look at that. There's the headpiece. There's the sensor stands and the controllers. Let's get to a better angle. This is the Oculus Go, and this is standalone. Um, so you don't need to be wired up to a computer or have sensors around to make it work. It comes with a little one hand controller. And of course you need to either hook it up to the computer to put programs on it and things like that. I guess it's kind of similar um, to the ones you can put like your Samsung phone in. Um, I haven't used it yet, so I can't really say too much more about it. So of course you saw in the box there's some promo items. There's a nice jacket. A note, the moleskin notepad and pen. The glass. 
Then the main thing, the Oculus Rift. So there's the headset for that. Got the headphones attached on the sides. Comes with two controllers. two sensors you need to set up in your room where you're going to use it. There you go. <laughs> so that's really cool. I've got to thank Oculus for that. And if you're into this sort of thing, give it a go. I can't really say much else because I haven't used it yet. <laughs> But uh, I'll probably upload some videos uh, when I start developing a few ideas I have for games and uh, experiences. Might even be a brewing one, who knows. <laughs> but um, I might have to start a new channel uh, and dedicate it to that so everyone doesn't get annoyed with brewing and game development. But we'll see what happens. I also want to quickly thank Wire Lightsoft Games, who uh, I've been giving a hand uh, developing some of their titles. They have a, um, a VR uh, roller coaster game out at the moment. I'll leave a link down the bottom for that. It's still in development, but it's been released and we're updating it all the time. I'll also leave a link down below if anyone's interested in looking at some of my old work. Uh, it needs a little bit of updating, but um, I might throw some on the end of this video too if I can find bits and pieces on the computer. There was one. I made a gold coin for my 30 years of brewing, which was last year. Um, I was going to put that on my videos for a laugh. There was one with a ghost and a destiny that I never ended up using. Maybe next week I'll show you how to make one of these. Can't work out how to make it come back yet. <laughs> Here's a Keg King one that was never used. Here's one I was doing when I was going to start brewing, you know, beers from all around the world. And this was done years and years ago. Um, with me flying from Australia uh, to Germany. Now, I can do people's intros and things for their videos if they like, um, and I can do them a lot better than I do my own, but it, it, it takes a long time, so it's not cheap. It's not really something uh, I can do for free, if you know what I mean, because it just takes a long, long time. Um, there's weeks and weeks of work, depending on what you want. If it's just a words and they don't have to move too much, that can be done relatively cheap, even some for free. <laughs> but, um, you know, once you start getting into full-on animations, that takes a lot of work and a lot of time. But we can always work something out, maybe. Anyway, that's it. Oculus like you to do this to show that you've, you know, got the kit and give them a little bit of advertising and plugs, and they deserve it too. This is great. Thank you very much. All right, cheers. Everything is gash, man. Everything is cool when you gash, man. Everything is gash, man. When you gash, man. Yeah.